All you low voltage nerds, check it out. We are at the Leviton booth here at NECA 2025 in Chicago, and we're going to learn a little bit about their products. But you know what's actually the coolest thing about their products is the training they offer on how to install and maintain their products. And we're here with Chuck Bowser, who you all may know as Chuck Bowser. <laughs> so, Chuck, let me hand you the microphone. Why don't you tell us a little bit about what you got going on here? So we're here, we got invited to do a, a low voltage booth here at NECA. NECA's trying to expand more to what's called limited energy now. We're getting away from that low voltage moniker. And so I came out here to represent the low voltage side of Leviton. And I'm here talking to people about our products, copper products, fiber products. But you know me, my forte is training people getting, and getting people to be better. So these are our fiber optic enclosures. So what you would have is you would have a fiber optic cable coming into the back of it, terminating into and coming plug into the back side of an adapter panel, and then your IT servers would plug their fiber patch board to the front of this, route it through one of the wire managers, and plug that right into the equipment. Like this is the thing. This is our top of the line enclosure. The cool thing about this is it has a tray inside of it. This tray can be pulled out, and you can terminate on on a, on a ter termination tray behind it. Or if you don't want to have to work between that small little space behind the rack and the wall, this tray can come out the front. Awesome. And you can terminate it in the front as well, and then. Data centers, they love having everything looking aesthetically pleasing. Right? <laughs> so they have that black metal door. We have those too, but so these are really good for data centers because it's got that nice, that nice comfy feel to them and stuff like that. This is one of our angle cassette systems. The beautiful thing about this is if you look on the back side of this, you'll see that they got MTP connectors. So you would run a 12 or 24 strand into that. And then this cassette will break that out into a couple different methods. So you can either break it out into an individual 12 strands or 24 strands. The, the cool thing about this is it's easily migratable. So you, if you want to convert to like a, from a 40 gig to a 10 or to 100 gig system, all you have to do is just literally just disconnect the fiber, plug in a 40 gig cassette or 100 gig cassette. That's all you got to do because it's already wired that way. And, those, and the pre-terminated fiber trunks, they come from the factory pre-terminated, pre-test. And so there's, all you got to do is plug them in and they work. That's, and that's the cool thing about that. And the pre-terminated trunk systems, are really good for contractors who they've been doing copper for many, many years and they've kind of been staying away from fiber because they don't have them skills as well. It's already pre terminated and pre tested. You just plug, fire it up, put it in, hit it with a tester, make sure you didn't pull too hard on something and broke it, and it's up and running. The key thing I will tell you is any fiber always, first number one, clean, clean, <laughs> clean, right? And, uh, and then scope. You always forget scope. You'll just say clean. Well, yeah, I, I consider every fiber connector, every fiber adapter panel, every fiber patch board is being dirty until you clean. Right? That's right. 